Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to today's game at HBF Stadium in Perth between the UTS Balmain Tigers and UWA Torpedoes women. My name's Danielle Woodhouse, and with me today is Sue Smith. Hi, Danielle. Good to be here. Sue, on a bit of a gloomy, rainy day here in Perth. Game is starting now. First swim up goes to UTS Balmain. Alice Williams. Is it? No, number 14. Sam Sheed. Is it? No, Glenda Morgan. <laughs> and our first goal through extra, scored by Rowie Webster, one of our great Australian representatives. Nice post move there. Nice turn. A very nice shot there. Rainy Remy gets the torps on the board. Let's hope this now gives them a bit of confidence to go forwards. It's always hard to get that first goal, isn't it? Yeah, let's see. Let's see. Let's see if they can reset that now, find a gap. Oh, nice. and that's a very nice goal by Maddie Rigo. Well placed. Good cross. Good cross uh, pass. Yeah, I think Jen Long Longman got a good piece of that. She'll be a bit cross with herself for letting that one in. But you shouldn't leave Alice Williams on her own. <laughs> Same as Robbie. Maybe it's funny, teams don't really defending teams don't seem to adjust to a three-three very often. You I'm know, surprised they haven't played it more yeah. today then, really. And that's the end of the game. Well, a bit of a slowdown there in the fourth quarter for the Torpedoes. Um, just a one goal, but it, it looked good. Well, good, good afternoon and welcome to Challenge Stadium, the home of the UWA Torpedoes for this OVO National Water Polo League clash between the Balmain Tigers and the UWA Torpedoes. My name is Mick Collis and joining me in commentary uh, World Cup winning gold medalist Sharon Wheelock and Sharon nice to have your company this afternoon. Thank you. We don't want to bring out what year that was either, no, do it was we? A Mick? long time ago, Sharon, a long time ago. Many, many years. We've got Lewis Putt. So for the torpedoes, Galen Patterson. But it was Balmain through Hugh Anstey. Ejection there called off number nine. For torpedoes. It's Devin Thumwood. So his first exclusion. Gulleve for the Tigers. Now to Anstey. So an extra man opportunity. It gets batted in by Ian Calpin. So the first goal of the match in favour of the Balmain Tigers. So 1 0. The visitors leading the UWA at torpedoes. Four and a half minutes remaining. So we just catch it on the replay here, Sharon. Great little pass into the post there. Catching the defenders off guard. Not much the goalkeeper can do about that. He has it now, sits at the top, finds to shoot, sends it back across to Robottom. Has the shot, winds up, and a nice shot from the youngster, Samuel Robottom. Terrific shot. Nice use of the ball, Sharon, and a good use of the timing that. He's got two majors on him now, and he's a pretty sharp shooter, so they won't want him to be out on three majors. So it comes right across to Murphy. Murphy pops oh. it into Oberman. And young Matthew Oberman finds the back of the net. That was a really good pass. We'll have a look at it on the OVO replay here, Sharon. Talk us through so it. So we see the pass coming in. It sees Matt's arm up. Great pass. So the defenders are caught behind. There's not much they can do about that. So and that's young Matt Murphy. Matt Murphy. So great vision. You can't teach that, Sharon. You can't teach it. You and I have got it, but you can't teach it. You can't teach it. So plenty going on in the centre forward there between Matthew Oman. It might be on here. So you can hear the crowd. It's boarding. It's Premier League football here. It's like we're in the back docks of England on a cold Sunday afternoon. Oh, Mick. The crowd are getting fired up. You've always got some... Um, what's that called when you do that? Insight. Oh. And a lovely shot there from Tom Powell against the run of play. 
just ignoring all the noise and the carry on in the water and Tom Howe will check him out as we have a look at this on the replay. It comes up from row bottom. Shot looks easy. You can just see that little... And just over the outstretched arm of Godfrey, I think it was. Just quickly, In fact, Mick, it was Calpin. It definitely was an insight that I thought that you had a lot of. <laughs> so Anstey with it. Hugh Anstey, he's got Hughes open. Ah, great save there, great defence. Oh, it's a big call, but have a look at it on the replay. Damo's doing it best he can to put him off. But Galeev, just that bottom corner, it's a tough one to save. And it's interesting, last time he took the penalty, he did bottom corner. As we look oh, at this on the replay go. here. Yeah. That's Connor Martin chewing up time. Gets away from Murphy. Connor still goes himself. He's got three. He'll have the shot to finish the game. No, he doesn't. He dumps it across in front of Galeev. And that will be a full time here at HBF Stadium. And it was the Tigers in the end running out victors by five goals to three over the Torpedoes. It was a much needed win for the Balmain side. That's all we have time for from HBS Stadium. It's been wonderful to have your company on this OVO National Water Polo League broadcast. On my McCall's behalf of Shane Wheelock, all the crew and also Daniel Woodhouse and Sue Smith. Thanks very much for your company and we'll see you next time. Good night from us.